What's up guys, it's Lou from Unbox Therapy and today we're taking a look at something called the Pico Dolly. Now what this device will do is make your videos more professional by adding some energy through the form of movement. Now traditionally Dolly systems have been very expensive and hard to use. This is really a different take on the idea of a Dolly, hence the name Pico Dolly. It is very tiny and easy to carry with you and will work with a number of different consumer electronics electronics devices from your smartphone to your point and shoot even all the way up to a digital SLR. Now before I get into this video right here and talking about the actual product, I do want to give a quick shout out to photojojo.com. They're the ones responsible for sending this out to me. If you guys don't mind, please visit their website. I'll put a link down in the description. Go check out what they've got to offer. It's not just the Pico Dolly. They've got a number of different tools available to help you out with your digital photography and video for that matter. So anyways, let's talk about what's going on here in front of you. The Pico Dolly is very easy to assemble. You take this arm portion attach it to the dolly portion and you've got a very flexible small form factor dolly for getting those moving shots there's also a clamp option that you can either install on top of the dolly or not the clamp will allow you to connect smartphones in this case here i've got a galaxy nexus up there of course an iphone would work just as well and here's a point and shoot camera, fairly hefty point and shoot camera, the HX9V from Sony, which will also work in the clamp. And uh, as you can see here, tons of adjustability, even once you've got the camera mounted up, it's just one knob and you lock it into place and you're good to go. Now you've got a traditional tripod style mount, which you can obviously use with larger cameras all the way up to digital SLRs. In my case with the Sony HX9V, I could have mounted it either with the clamp or with the tripod mount. I ended up going with the tripod mount so I get a better view of the LCD. Now the materials in use here are all rock solid. It feels fairly professional considering the price point. This thing retails for only 90 bucks, so very affordable when you consider what you're getting for your money. Now here's something special about the Pico Dolly. You can actually adjust the angle of the wheels, which allows for these curved kinds of moving shots right here, which are very impressive to look at when you see the finished product, which will come at the end of the video. Now the construction here, as I mentioned before, is all very solid. I'm very impressed. You've got aluminum components or steel components, alloy components everywhere. No plastic to be found except for maybe a couple of the knobs. So here's what I was talking about. Here's how you get those moving shots that I was mentioning earlier, whether it be product, a video that you're doing like I do, or maybe even creative stuff where you want to use a dolly for, you know, adding some production value to the end product. You can do simple sort of dolly shots where you're just panning. You can come up close on an object or use those curves as I mentioned before. Now this is all fine and dandy. I can show you all this stuff right here, but why not show you how it actually performs when you're trying to make these shots for yourself? So I'm going to let you guys sit back here for a quick second and see what I was able to come up with. All right, check this out. Now, as you guys can see, you can get some very, very effective camera movements with this Pico Dolly, really upping the production value of whatever kind of video you want to put together. You know me, I make product videos, and this thing is really going to up my game. I'm sure of it. Anyway, guys, as I mentioned before, please do visit that link below to go check out photojojo.com. I got to give them a big thanks, a big thumbs up for sending this thing out to me and letting me make this video to show you guys what it's all about and how to improve your videos. So anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this content, please do like and favorite the video as it does help me out a bunch. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do that too. And until next time, I'll catch you guys around the channel. All right, later. Mm -hmm.